Speak if you can. What are you? All hail Macbeth. Hail to thee, Thane of Glamis. All hail Macbeth. Hail to thee, Thane of Cardor. All hail Macbeth. Thou shalt be king hereafter. Bless up that Macbeth. I'm greater. Not so happy, but much happier. Thou shalt get kings. Though thou be not. So all hail Macbeth and Banquo. Banquo and Macbeth. All hail. Stay, you imperfect speakers. Tell me more. By Sinal's death, I know I am Thane of Glamis. But how of Cawdor? The Thane of Cawdor lives, a prosperous gentleman, and to be king. Stands not within the prospect of belief. No more than to be Cawdor. Stay from whence you owe this strange intelligence, or why upon this blasted health you stop our way with such prophetic greeting. Speak, I charge you. The king hath happily received, Macbeth, the news of thy success, and, for an earnest of a greater honor, he bade me from him call thee Thane of Cawdor, in which addition hail most worthy Thane, for it is thine. The Thane of Cawdor lives. Why do you dress me in borrowed robes? Who was the Thane lives yet, but under heavy judgment bears that life which he deserves to lose. Glamis and the Thane of Cawdor? The greatest is behind. Thanks for your pains. That trusted home might yet enkindle you unto the crown. But signs the thane of Cawdor. But tis strange. And oftentimes to win us harm, the instruments of darkness tells us truths. Win us with honest trifles to betray in deepest consequence. If chance will have me king, why? Chance may crown me without my stir. Come what come may, time and the hour runs through the roughest day. The Prince of Cumberland, that is a step on which I must fall down, or else o'er a leap, for in my way it lies. Whilst I threat he lives, the bell invites me. Hear it not, Duncan, for it is a knell that summons thee to heaven or to hell. I've done the deed. What hands are here? Ha! They pluck out mine eyes. With all great Neptune's ocean, wash this blood clean from my hand. Thou hast it now, King, Cawdor, Glamis, just as the weird woman promised. Yet it was said, it should not stand in thy posterity but that myself should be the root and father of many kings. If, there come from, if the truth come from them, as many thee, Macbeth, their speeches shine. Why, by the verities of thee made good, may they not be my oracles as well, and set me up in hope. The seed of Banquo kings? Rather than so, come fate into the list, and champion me to thy utterance. Double, double, toil and trouble, fire burning, cauldron bubble. How now, you secret and black midnight hags? What is it you do? Come high or low, thyself in office deathly shall. Macbeth, Macbeth, Macbeth!
Beware, Macduff, beware the thing of fife. Dismiss me, enough. Where thou art for thy good caution, thanks thou hast harped my fear all right. Macbeth, 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 be bloody, bold, and resolute. Laugh to scorn the power of man, for none of women born shall harm Macbeth. Then live, Macduff. What need I fear of thee? But yell, make, I'll make assurance, double sure, and take a bond of fate that I shall not live, that may I tell, pale hearted fear it lies, and sleep in spite of thunder. Who shapes, who frets, or where conspires are, Macbeth shall never be vanquished until great Berman would. To hide Dunstanane, Hill shall come against him. That will never be. Who can impress the forest, bid the tree unfix his earthbound root? Sweet bow means. Bring me no more reports. Let them fly all. Till Berman Wood removed to Dunsinane, I cannot taint with fear. The devil damn thee black, thou cream-faced loon. Where gotst thou, goose look? There are ten thousand, sir. Geese, villain? Soldiers, sir. What soldiers, Patch? Death of thy soul. Those linen checks of thine are counselors to fear. What soldiers way face? The English force. So please you. Bring it after me. I will not be afraid of death. And bane. Till Berman Forest come to Dunsinane. Gracious, my lord, I should report that which I say I saw, but know not how to do it. Well, say it, sir. As I did stand my watch upon the hill, I looked toward Burnham, and anon, methought, the wood began to move. Liar and slave! Let me endure your wrath, if it be not so. Within this three mile, may you see it coming. I say, a moving grove. To doubt the equivocation of the fiend that lies like the truth. Fear not, till Burnham Wood do come to Dunsinane, and now a wood comes towards Dunsinane. That way the noise is. Tyrant, show thy face. Enough thou, Macbeth, or else my sword with an unbattered edge sheathe again undeeded. Why should I play the Roman fool and die on my own sword? While I see lives, the gashes do better upon them. Turn, Hellhound, turn! Of all men else, I have avoided thee. I have no work. My voice is in my sword. Thou bloodier villain than terms can give thee out. Thou losest labor, and I bear a charmed life which must not yield to one of woman born. Despair thy charm. Accursed be that tongue that tells me so, and be these juggling fiends no more believed that palter with us in a double sense, that keep the word of promise to our ear and break it to our hope. I'll not fight with thee. Then yield thee, coward, and live to be the show and gaze of thee time. I will not yield to kiss the ground before young Malcolm's feet, and to be baited with the rabble's curse. Lay on, Macduff, and damn thee him for the first cries. Hold thee up. Then you should be me. Shut.
Beth, Mick, Beth, Mick, Beth. Bloody bold and resolute. Laugh just go back. Like, bad man, God.